You are watching a Loading Ready Run Wacky Draft on MTGO Academy. Hey everybody, it's Loading Ready Run Drafting. Woo! Graham here. James here. And Cube here. Cube. Cube is here. This is the new Cube, the Legacy Cube? Is I don't that what it's, what it's called? called? Hang on. Yes, Legacy, yes, Legacy Cube. Cube. And um I mean, this is the first time that I've played this cube. I have not played this cube either. So we should start it with the... Uh, start slow. With the, the, you know, the test. I of, like it. Of mono red. Sure. But our red options are kind of poopy. So it's probably like Boros Charm. <laughs> That's <laughs> not Blood mono red. red. Well, mono red can splash white sometimes. What does this even do? Put a creature from your hand on the battlefield, it gains haste. Oh, okay, so you just get to, like, uh, no. And Bushwhacker is fine i guess but it'll probably come around <laughs> yeah all right good good mono red pick Ooh, hey mortars. mortars sold what's the rest of this wow yeah, garrick Brago. Brago. Ah, i got some conspiracy cards in y'all yeah. yeah fetch lands kitchen fanks but we have mizzy mortars yeah, so we, who cares exactly good filling out this two drop burn slot does this hit players no no all right well we're on our way incinerate does Huh. Holy. Huh. Wow, we could have gone Sun Titan into... Angel of Serenity? Yeah. Maybe we should have gone Mono White. Oh, well. <laughs> it's possible Mono Red it just isn't as good in this cube. I have no idea. I really haven't... I haven't watched anybody play it. No, I think I I've seen... I have read the list. <laughs> I think I've seen, like, Marshall do a draft. I think that's it. all I've seen, maybe. I honestly don't know. I mean, Mono Red's kind of always a thing. It sh it's supposed to be. Yeah. So, I don't know. I mean, we're going to make it a thing. Yeah, it's it's going to be a thing for us, regardless of whether or not it's actually a thing. Uh, ah, Hellrider. Hellrider. Yeah, yeah. Oh, also Goblin Bombardment. Bombardment. That's, that, that, that's a cool inclusion. Yeah. Uh, I mean, we might be able to get that back, actually. Yeah. I mean, also... Meyer, Peaks, Prof Bolt. Don Reed. Don't, look at all the Garricks up in here. <laughs> we just passed. Passed the Garrick. We just passed the Garrick. Two Garricks two, there. Double Garrick. All right. Wow. Well, Hellrider is... Yeah. I like Hellrider. No, Hellrider's great for us. Um, ooh. Hmm. Uh, so, so there's Jackal, Jackal Pup with the old school art. Which Super is, aggressive. Which is pretty cool. Uh, Firebolt. Aristocrat. Um, I see we go Jackal Pup. Yeah, just... 2-1 two, for 2, or 2-1 two, for 1. Wait. Is this combo... Is Exarch Twin in the cube? I don't know. I think it is. I think I saw someone say that it was. Ugh. That's not okay. Gross. Phoenix. Hey, oh, do you, do you, uh, probably. Uh, I think we just take the Phoenix. I think so. We're gonna be able to get it back with things, and it triggers things, and yeah, I yeah. like it. All right. Fingers crossed. I mean, we're more likely to wheel this over Magma Jet. Probably. Yeah. I mean, I could. I mean, but. Uh, Eh, there's a, there's also a lot of land here, so someone might just be like, whatever, I'll just take the Phoenix. Yeah. Yeah, just uh, take the Phoenix. Yeah. We're never going to get the Magma Jet back, but that's fine. That's fine. There, there's lots more burn to be to be had. Look at this. Look how this is coming together already. Yeah. Outstanding. I like that they went with the old Jackal Pub art. Yeah, that's weird. Oh, well. What is she holding? She has like a... <coughs> she has the Golden Snitch. Wow. Hey! Ooh. Ugh. I mean... Oh, wow. Perforos is kind of fun. What does the claws do again? So crazy, it's, a, it's a firebolt... Or fire, fire, sorry, fireball. That yeah. You can't split. With, and and you get random ferocious be which benefit. Is, I don't think... Also, I, gutter snipe? Yeah. It's kind of awesome. It's kind of interesting, actually. I mean... How many cards here? We, we're going to get something back out of this pack. We're probably... I doubt we're going to get the red cards. It'll probably be this or this. It might be. You know what? Let's take Perforos. That seems yeah, fun. Yeah, that's way too much fun. Also, look at all this uh, Look at all this devotion. Yeah, exactly. Well, with the two double red creatures, yeah. Get in. That seems like fun. Ooh, speaking of which. Ooh, uh, uh, oh my god. Uh, okay. What do, you, what do you take? Mono red is open. <laughs> what do you take? Like probably the red. I think you take I got the... I got more excited as I moved to the right. I was like, oh, burning tree. I, <laughs> well, I mean, maybe frenzy goblin burning tree is like yeah. whatever. But then uh, it's between these two. <laughs> I think it's murderous cap. Is it? I don't know. Uh, I mean, really good for perforos, and yeah. you know it it. Deals this is damage. just like three, four damage. I think it's Stoke. Whoops. Oh, good. Uh, I took the Stoke. Stoke. Okay. Well, Bushwhacker. Sweet. Like, you can cast this off the creatures, though, then we oh, yeah. needed a creature, which that was, well, whatever. Yeah. 
This is okay. I don't know. Yeah. No, I dig this. I dig this. Um. <coughs> hey. War Marshal. Yeah. Man, if we get that goblin bombardment, which we probably will, I would think. Isn't even, isn't that just it's just creatures with a goblin bar, bombardment? Yeah, it? but just that he makes tokens yeah, yeah, is yeah. the only reason. So, oh, that's cool because we can pop Chandra's Phoenix to the bombardment and then cast something and get it back in our hand. Yep. It's a, it's slow. As long as well, dragon fodder. Sure. Yep. Don't need their sheep and reef. Dagron fodder. Yeah. There it is. Yeah, I think I want that over the teetering peaks. This just seems like fun. Yep. Get lots of little tokens. Do enough damage to then we just scoop our board and <laughs> kill them. And then they're like to randomly gain life somehow. Because it's the cube and I don't know what's in this one. This is a big change to the cube. Um over uh, what it's been like for the last couple of years. Like, it's, this is the biggest change. Yeah, it got smaller, did it not? It got it smaller, small. and... Um, wow. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Why not? Maybe we run that. Um, uh, it's now, like, more different from the Holiday Cube. Yeah. Which is the one with power. Uh, wow. Okay, Necrotal, which, by the way, again, old Necrotal art, which is a very strange choice. Yeah. <laughs> Gutterstein. Yes. I think. Yes. Cut, cut the the cards that we can't cast right now. All right. Just for now, because I think we are like, well, there's a Badlands, but there's, there's a also Badlands. a Zealous Construct, oh. which I really like. There's also a Searing Spear, which is you know not bad. Like uh, this is more likely to come around, but probably. I don't know. Hmm. I don't actually know. I don't think we take the Badlands. I think no. we just we stick with the mono red. I don't. I, do we take Searing Spear over Cons I think we take Searing Spear. I All think right. you're right. I think it's probably more likely the... I mean, look how much stuff stuff is in this pack. Yeah, uh, and uh, like, uh. nothing for us, so... Yeah. I think right. we just cross our fingers. Uh, Dagger Shock, also gross, by the way. Yeah. Um, Electromancer, no, because no. we don't have the thing. Cackler, Cackler's I think it's... bad. I mean, Hordling Outburst, Cackler, Stagger Shock, these are all good. Yeah. We don't have a way to, like, abuse lots of tokens yet. Except, of course, for Goblin Bombardment. Yeah. So, you know. Is it a creature or player? It is. Yeah. <laughs> yes. One mug to aim the catapult. One mug to steer the rock. Yeah. Um, um, I mean, burn is always good, right? Yeah, I think we just take this, this shock. Yeah. I'd be happy with either of these coming back. I It'll feel, probably I feel be like, this one. Yeah, I feel or like. Or both of them. Yeah. So, all right. Stagger shock. Uh, ooh. Ooh. Uh, I mean, I I think he, I want the helix. And helix is cool. We really need fixing. For yeah. That. Also, sublime archangel. <laughs> Our mono white deck would be kind of ridiculous. <laughs> but Our mono red deck is pretty sweet. Yeah. Yeah, I think I want to take the helix and definitely try to pick up some sort of fixing for that. Some sort of white fixing. Yeah. Yeah. All right, Charmin, you get back in. Hey, look, more Garricks. Uh, the goal is to find all of them. Wow, I think we have, haven't we? Is there four or five? Uh, maybe there's five. I think there's five. Yeah. So I think we're one. So down. War Driver, War Driver's good. Volley. Brimstone Volley also very good. Probably Brimstone Volley. Yep. Only got seven creatures, but boy, do we have a lot of burn. Yeah. Uh, yeah. There's also, there, there was also a Vindicate in that pack. Well, there's a Lightning Strike. Imperial Recruiter. Inches of what are we made switch. of money? When Inches of Alpha switch your card with power two or less, reveal it, put it in your hand. Uh. That mm. card is generally pretty good. I don't know if it's finding. It's really good in like decks that I don't know. We don't have a really good way to abuse it right now, so I think we just It gets take... like the Phoenix, does it not? Uh, yes, it does. Like, it that's does. probably the best target for it. Okay. And Gutter Snipe, it doesn't it's hit. not getting yeah. that, it's not getting that. Yeah, yeah. just the Lightning Strike. Yeah, Perforos is looking a little weird, but whatever. Hey, Rel. I guess we'll take big Gargs here. Yeah, we, maybe... don't, we don't take Mutavolt. Actually. <laughs> maybe just take the Mutavolt. I mean, this is another option to be let's just like... <laughs> Just like wipe wipe out all our permanents and get a Gargadon, but yeah, yeah, yeah I think the mute vault is actually over one. Yeah. All right. Definitely want some sort of white fixing. Nope. Wow, this is this is the first, first time pack. we haven't we haven't like <laughs> really had a pick. I mean, obviously there was the Necrotol and the other thing, but this so is what's like, like the worst card here for us? Ravages. Well, most of our stuff is pretty low. 
Uh, like one Lily? of the walkers, I guess. Probably just take Lily. Sure. Banisher Priest, I guess, is not great. Like this, we don't want to run this just for the white. That's dumb. No. Yeah, so, yeah sure. we'll take Lily. Uh, hmm. Ugh. Uh, actually, yeah, Kiln Fiend, could, Kiln be, Fiend Kiln is... could be pretty sweet in this deck. Yep. All right. There's a Conscripts. Swig. Also. Yeah, but we're not really splashing the black. We're splashing... No. Hey, they both came back. Both came back. Okay, uh, so... Ooh. I th think maybe it's just the... The Cackler, you yeah, were going to say? I feel like it's going to be the Cackler. I don't know. I like a couple early one-drops, and like... Yeah, like, that's cute. It's uh, super cute. It's adorable. I mean, we have Dragon Fodder. We have... Um, War Marshal. War Marshal. Eh... It's good chumpers, too. It is, yeah. I do like 2-2. Two, two uh, okay. Yeah, we'll take the cackler. Well, cool. take that. That's sure. <laughs> All right. All right, so... Well, we have creatures now. We have 23 cards right now. Yep. Here's, here's the deck currently. Well, I but mean... We, we need some land. We cut the helix and we add two more cards right now. <laughs> Unless we get some fixing. Mm-hmm. I, I'm, I'm enjoying this. Also, I don't know if we actually play Mutavolt. I don't know what that actually... It's a it's a dude to smash with. I guess. I think if you're running mono, you totally run it. Wow. Uh, yeah, whatever, screw it. Yeah, I'll take the line. Yep. We, can't, we basically can't kill that. Actually, we totally can. What am I talking about? Ooh. Do we play this? Um, I don't know if we play it, but we take it. Yeah. Because maybe we do. All right, we still actually have another pack left. We have another entire pack. That's ridiculous. That's I, really good. I would play this deck right yeah, now. I'd play this deck right now, absolutely. I mean, I would with with some white fixing. Well, there's a cliff top. But there's, there's also, also a beetleback, beetleback chief, chief slagstorm, slag <laughs> burst lightning. Oh man! All okay. right. So what's more important, being able to play those two splash <clears throat> white cards, or just taking uh, the beetleback chief to combo off even more with our bombardment? <laughs> I feel like that's the that's the plan. I feel like we take the chief. Well, we should have taken the hordling up first, then, but still. Uh, like a wrath is good. Like this, this won't come back. We might see this back. That's kind. Of, I mean, that kills all of our stuff too. Though. Oh yeah. Yeah, I think you're right. I think we take the chief. Also, more creatures is good with Hellrider. Yep. All right. Ooh. Oh, bonfire. <laughs> Snap. I don't even care what else is in here. Helix. Uh, pff, whatever. What, what does this even do? Oh. Uh, no. Oh, no. That's like a worse goblin bombardment. <laughs> that being said, like... What is even yeah. happening in this pack? Yeah. It's cube. Bonfire, get in. Um, Jeez, there's an Archangel of Thune. What we could have so many amazing... We could have had... The crazy boy. We could have had stick. Sun Titan, uh -huh. Angel of Serenity, yep. uh, Archangel of Thune, Sublime Archangel. Sublime Archangel. Yup. So, Spike Shot? Probably. Or Seal of Fire, which uh, is just a shock. A shock that you cast weirdly. Yeah. Probably Take the Elder. Alright. Duh. Um. Gee. More fireballs, I guess. Yeah. And ones that can flashback are always fun. Yeah. We're going to have to make some serious cuts. <laughs> oh, come on. Come on. There's also a chain lightning. Why you got to do this? Why? Wow. Hmm. Is this, is this card even that crazy in the context of this deck? Probably not. Do we just take Battlefield Forge? I feel like we have a lot of burn. Yeah. I mean, I don't know if we're actually... Like, I don't know if we want to play those two, the Boros and the War Leader Helix, off of one forge. But like if we... If, if we take... If we take this, we could maybe get, an, <clears throat> maybe get another one. But if we don't take this, then we're j definitely not playing these. Yeah. I, like, I'm okay with not playing those, because the rest of our cards are pretty bonkers right now. Yeah. Like, I mean, I, I, I like the life gain, but you're right. So like what? Still so chain lightning? Chain lightning. Okay. Yeah. Over the Phoenix? I think so. I don't know. The Phoenix doesn't seem that crazy good. All right. Heck, we might wheel it. Burn. Of course there's the plateau. <laughs> but hey, there's a hammer of Perforos, and there's a Gorehound Chainwalker. I like the Chainwalker, actually. It's just a good two-drop. 
What is it? What? What? That's crazy. That's really crazy, actually. Wow, okay. <coughs> Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I don't know. I, I guess you're right. Like, we shouldn't. If we don't have to splash, we shouldn't. Yeah, like I think we just keep uh, taking the red cards. All right. So hammer or like? Uh, uh, no, that's too slow. Like we're not doing that. So I think we just take the two drop All right. and just continue to be like crazy aggressive. Flame I mean, slash. Franco's command gets us more. That's true. It's functional reprint of dragon fodder. Yep. But flame slash is also really good. Yep. Um. We are definitely going to need to start making some cuts. Yeah, I think we take Slash. It's cheap, too. Oh, God, yes! Oh, it gets in there all day, every day. Pity about all those white cards we passed. Yeah. <laughs> all right, get in. What does this even do? Put Tempting X 1-1 one, one red elemental creatures with haste on the battlefield. <coughs> each opponent may put that many for each player who does. So you get X. And then they can and do... And they can do X, but for every one that they do, you get another one. So if you do it for three... And then they choose to get three. You get three more. Yeah. <laughs> All right. That's super cool. It's, actually, it's kind of wonky, but, but it's no, not. It's, it's no. Storm, it's no storm breath dragon. Oh, there's slag came around. Uh, so or burst lightning. Burst lightning or slag storm. Um. Um. I don't know. I don't know either. I, I mean, think. I think um, it's slag storm. I think it's probably. I don't think we main board Slag Storm though. Like I think we just bring that in. That's so. fair. It's it's definitely a more powerful effect. Um, Jeez. Uh, board, because sure. this is terrible, and uh, we've we're already yeah priced out of playing these. So all right. Sure. Uh, maybe just cut the student. That card kind of good. No, we have so many ways to kill it. Yeah. I mean. All right. But then what do we take? We're taking another way to kill it. Actually. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right. Sure. Uh. Yes. Uh, yeah, sure. We'll kill people before the other thing is relevant. Whoa. All right, cube yo. <laughs> sure. That's funny. <laughs> got the hammer. And eight and a half tails. Oh my god, we need to cut so many cards. Okay, these are the kind of problems you want to have. So, one drops. Yeah, <laughs> we have uh, a, we, we have a couple. Chain lightning. Like, they're all good. That's the problem. Yeah. Like, maybe we don't need Devil's Play. Because uh, we have Bonfire. Yeah, Devil... I like... Maybe... What's Spike Shot Elder do again? Uh, it's the... Deals damage equal to its power. So, yeah. actually, probably cut that. Cut that. As a one drop. But, like, it's nice to have something to do with your mana every turn, but I feel yeah. like we're okay in that regard. Also, we can we can absolutely get away with 16 land in this deck. Oh, yeah. Like, we've got these two five drops, and that's it. No, oh, yeah. We're definitely playing. This um, is probably a three drop most of the time. We're playing... All of the higher drops. Um, I, I, I want to play Perforos. Yeah, I think <laughs> like we can play Perforos. Maybe he's not great, but... Um, all right, let's see about cutting... Uh, what's the... Let's cut the... I like our one drops right now. Mm -hmm. Gives us something early to do. What, what are our two drops here? Wait, what's the Bushwhacker do again? Oh. Isn't it just not block? Oh, no, it gets no, plus one. Everything plus gets plus one, plus oh, and haste. I kind of like that. Mm -hmm. um, so Borderland Marauder. That one's fine. Yeah. Firefly Striker, uh, Battalion. So if we attack with three, then yeah, something, something can't, can't block. block. That's probably like up there. I like that guy. Kill me seems yeah, really seems fine. Strong here. War Marshal's, War Marshal's good. good. War Driver's fine. I think probably this. Probably this one or this one. Yeah, I if, feel if, like if, I, if, we're, if we're looking to cut a two drop creature, we got sixteen creatures, so cutting one would not be that bad. Probably the War Driver. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I think. Sure. I mean, to be fair, War Driver is really good with um, all the goblins we're, we're making. Because Battle Cry. Yeah, that's true. Well, we've got... Okay, yeah, 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 no, do that. Yeah, we actually have a lot of... Yeah, yeah get, right. get Striker, rid of striker. Out, War Driver in. Okay. A lot of goblins. I like... So that, I think that's good for so creatures. That's a kind of that's a creature. creature. Uh, that's it, we've got the Bombardment, that's good. Oh, I like all of these. These are all good. Um... Mortars is that's super very good. good. Flame Slash is pretty good. Like this only yeah. Flame Slash might be like some of the worst ones we have here because it can only hit creatures, but it does do four. I mean this this is staying in yep. because uh Stagger Shock is good, Brimstone Volley is Volley. Good. 
Stoke is good. All right, maybe we, we gotta make we gotta make three more cuts. All right, well in that case, I guess we'll take out Flame Slash. Um, <coughs> maybe we don't play Perforos. <laughs> Aw, <laughs> buddy. I mean, I guess he's. What does he do again? Whenever you you get a shock, whenever you down. whenever a creature enters the battlefield. Yeah, that's way too much fun, though. I don't want to get rid of him. Right? Works well with Goblin Bombardment. Every creature does two good. Does two coming in and one, one leaving. Going, uh, yeah. Um. But then we don't want to cut that many creatures. No. But our spells are really good. We have to cut two more cards, right? Yes. No. Yes. Yes. Sorry, I can count. Mm -hmm. All right, I think we need to cut a creature and a spell. I don't think we can cut two of each. Incinerate's very good. So Incinerate, Lightning Strike, and Searing Spear are basically the same card. Uh, Lightning Strike and Searing Spear are actually the same card, and Incinerate just means that the creature can't be regenerated. Yep. Um, Maybe Stagger Shock? Oh, Stagger Shock's really good. They're all good. I put Dragon Fodder up here, don't forget. Yep. Like... Jackal pup? I like uh maybe. Yeah, sure. Alright. And get, then get one it. one more non creature spell? Like one of the bolts? Probably. Uh, which one do we like the least? Uh Siren Spear. I mean if I had to choose between Siren Spear or Lightning Strike at Siren Spear. Alright. Sure. Uh, we have so many other good cards we're not playing. Yeah. Alright. Add basics. What? What? Oh, the cackler, I see. Yeah. No, get out. And then if you wanted to play the Mutavolt, now would be the time. Oh, to right, yeah. Mutavolt's good. Uh, yeah. Alright. That seems fun. Yeah. Alright. Round one. Do you love to play Magic Online but have a tight budget? Check out MTG Academy's Academy Budget Bot in the Magic Online Classifieds. All cards in stock are cheaper than one event ticket. Yeah, alrighty. We do want to play first with this deck, I think. Done. Yeah, that seems fine. <laughs> it's not... Honestly, it's probably not even that good of a hand for this deck. No, but... Two drop, burn out your guy. Perforos on four. Hopefully. Yeah. Like, should I just have burned him there? That seems bad. I don't know. It's probably bad. Her opponent clearly has stops on every single... Every single phase. Alright, what's your amazing turn one play? Let's do it. Island, go. I am serum vision, so no, that's way better than ours. We're in an all, we're in an awful lot of trouble. Do we care how they scry? I guess maybe. Probably not. It's far too much work. Bottom, um, top. Uh, all right. Check this out. War driver. Go. Deal with it. Look at that guy. He's got a big mouth and he's angry. We're all going right. to kill whatever you play. <clears throat> Fact. And then hit you for two, because Battlecry doesn't hit himself. Well, get Perforos down on curve. Actually, War Driver's really good for Perforos Devotion. Yep. <laughs> Island, go. That would scare me. Yeah, I guess that would be bad. Yeah. I would not I would not like that. I want him to be like Forest <laughs> Lotus Cobra. Yeah. And then I can be like... I think I want him to go anything X3. <laughs> yeah. Go. Tap out for a creature of X3 that doesn't have Hexproof. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that can't somehow be regenerated for free. Oh, Okay, coast. well, he's got... He's got that double blue. Attack. Hmm. Definitely could have... Could have drawn some more spells by now, but here we are. We're going to attack you with our war driver, and there's nothing you can do about it. There's nothing. You can just let it happen. Just let it happen. There we go. 
Yes. What's the worst that he could do? Oh god, don't do anything. So do we kill him here? Or not kill him. Do we Burn chain him? lightning him? Just to do something? Maybe? Eh. Like next turn we can... Perforos. Although it doesn't really do anything. No, it doesn't. Eh. We also can't stoke because we attacked, but that's okay. I, yeah, I'm okay with it. Like we have... Ooh, sorry. Seven damage in our hand, so... Yeah. That's nice. We just gotta get him to seven. Black? What? I like this. The more colors I see, <laughs> the less likely they're gonna be able to do a thing. All of a sudden, we're against Bug. Bug. Oh, yeah. Bug is good. Bug There's is a lot good. of good cards going around. You know what's better? Mono red. Apparently. Opponent's still not... Come on! Alright, attack! I want to. I want to draw Beetleback Chief next turn, so that we can like dome our opponent for six off of Perforos triggers, and then also chain lightning for for fun. That's assuming that Perforos doesn't get countered here. Yeah, which is a big assumption. Like I'm just, I'm like seventy five percent that Perforos gets something. <laughs> I think I'm okay with it. Oh yeah, I'm fine with it. I don't care. Let's see your counter spell, sir. I mean, if he counters it and we draw like another one of our double red creatures, I'm kind of sad. I guess. But other than that, actually, Beetleback Chief would be really good. Yeah. Because then we get to play it, hit for because he makes two goblins. Yep. Hit uh, shock for six off of Perforos triggers. Then Perforos gets to attack, and he resolved. Okay. In fact, he goes to one if that happens. Um, rem remember, are you factoring in the battle cry on yes. Perforos? Because that makes the war driver a 3 2. No, a 2 2. But the battle cry would affect Perforos. Or Perforos, yeah, 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 sorry. So that'd be nine damage in creatures. And six. Plus, yeah. <laughs> so he takes. Well, damage. then we have a chain lightning. Yes. Yeah. So let's top deck Beetleback Chief. All right. And. I guess, I don't know, tap out to draw some cards. Sure. <laughs> what do we have in the deck that has double red? Hell, Hell Rider would Hell be good. Hell Rider would be very good. Um, uh, Beetleback uh, Chief, as we said. Storm Breath Dragon. Storm Breath Dragon. Sir? Just nothing. All right. <coughs> well, we didn't draw it, but that's fine. Uh, I guess play the Marauder. I'm doing that now so that I can attack with the uh, uh, War Driver and still have um, Stoke. Yep. Convoke up. Stokey Convokey. Alright, opponent definitely getting low in the life realm. Seven cards in hand. Scry. Oh, yeah, scry on top. Doing nothing. All right. Feeling good. Very tempted to end of turn stoke our opponent to the face. Probably we will. Any any permanent gets Perforos online next turn. Yeah. Okay. I feel like, oh, nope, I was expecting something end of turn there, so. And we could have had a much faster start than this, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, he's doing something. <laughs> <laughs> Arena. Really? All right. That's a good card. It's a great card. But, yeah, he's going to die. Super dead, though. Four, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, he's dead. Like, forget Perforos. We have he's seven to the face in hand and then this on board. Yeah, no, he's just dead. This is six, two... Five, six. This is four. Yeah, it's six on the six ground. Is, six and, attacks, yeah. yeah. All right. That's a rough play. 
to have to do. All right, stoke. Stoke. Stoke it up. Stoke. I want to stoke you. Please move to your end step, sir. Sir? Sir, I wish to stoke your flames. Or our, or, own, not. or our own flames and throw the flames at you. To be honest, I'm a little unclear on whose flames are being stoked, but... I, I think we stoke them in his general direction. Mm, we stoke the flames at yeah at him. We we get down and we blow the blow the flames to right. make them hotter and aim them. I gotta shut up now. Okay. <laughs> oh, crap, he's countering it. This is like miscalc or force spike. All right. Oh well. Okay. Any red permanent. He had, to, he had to take a... Yeah, he had to take some damage He there. had to take one damage to do that. I cannot pay for Force Spike. Could I pay... If I had another untapped creature, because this is not a creature, could I have paid for the Convoke on... Like, uh, could I have paid for Force Spike with Convoke? I don't think so. I don't think so. Really? What? Come on! Really? All right. Uh, wait, he's still dead, though, isn't he? Yes, yes. Because we can give creatures plus two, plus one, plus zero oh from Perforos, and yeah. then Chain Lightning them. So, yeah. So attack and, and activate Perforos and then cast Chain Lightning. So that's six. He'll take eight from the attack. Here. Right. So it's exactly. Yeah. Unless he's got something for a single black, which I don't think he does. In fact, we could do that twice, can't we? Does that also kill him? No, that doesn't kill him. No, you're right. That doesn't kill him. Chain lightning. That 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 gets him to one. Which then <laughs> tie on his upkeep. No, that's hilarious. Do it. <laughs> so mean. So mean. <laughs> that, that, that's bad manners. <laughs> Why are we so awful? He doesn't know we have a chain lightning. That's true. I mean, if he ever watches this. Oh. He's probably going to be like, that's so mean. You, Sorry. You I, one weird. of my greatest delights is letting someone die to their own Phyrexian Arena or their own Dark Confidant or, you yeah, know, something. or, or, or. That only worked because he had to, he had to, he had to ping uh, himself with the coast. Ping himself with the coast, yeah. If he hadn't have pinged himself with the coast, we would have only been able to get him to one with that. Still would have gotten the arena though, right? Yeah. So. Maybe he can cast something in his upkeep to save him. It's possible. In which case, fair play. Yeah. Like we 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 got a little greedy. We didn't go for the for the kill so that we could <laughs> win quote with style. Yeah. Tanking on our end step. <laughs> Filthy. This is a six two right now. Yep. Good job, Perforos. <laughs> got there. Yeah. What could they have? They would have to, like... Oh, ability is on the stack. And oh, it's, it's upkeep. You can't even... Yeah, yeah you can't respond. Yeah, yeah. okay. All right. Well, Sideboarding, no, because we saw almost nothing. Yeah, it's like... Um, that, I mean, he's he's... I think he's more control. Yeah. And I think he just didn't have the control there, so... I think we just go back. Yup. Like we've always said... The nice thing about mono red is you win or lose quickly. Yep. I hope the games are really fast and someone looks at like the the version of this on the MTGO Academy YouTube and they're like, "Oh, this is so short. They must have tried an 8-4 and lost it." <laughs> yeah. Lost in the second round. Like, no. No, we just rock face with our our deck. Yeah. Bonfire. What are you doing there? What what? No, come on. You're not. You're uh, supposed to be like six or seven cards down right now. Still, this will be good. Yeah. Um, do we just it's, turn one this guy? <coughs> probably. This end is actually kind of boring. Mm hmm. Um, but. I think it's a keep, though. Yeah. All right. Like, this is not the best hand our deck could have, but then neither was the last one. So. No. Oh, that's a good. Oh, that's a better what? start. Wow. Nice. Turn one serum. That serum visions again. Let's hope this works out better for our opponent this time. Well, no, let's not hope. I that. mean, he went bottom top. That's that's true. Top, top, bottom, bottom. All right, all right. So the opposite of last game. Sure. Fuck. 
you know what? Fine, get in. Start chipping away. Every point matters, Bushwhacker. Boy, I hope we draw something we can cast with two mana next turn. We've got so many two-drop spells. Like, creatures and spells. So many. And then we get to... Then we get Gutter Snipe down, and then everything just... Gets Sorry, shocking. Gets everything. plus two damage. Like, can you imagine a morbid brimstone volley with Gutter Snipe? That's seven, seven damage. damage. It's so good. All right. Value. What you got? Please cast something else that involves you pinging yourself with the Alvin Echoes. <laughs> I think that'd be really funny. We have our streaming chat room open on the other monitor, and I keep thinking that they're watching. <laughs> it's not as bad as it gets during Desert Bus, though. That's fair. Did our opponent just... Okay, no, they're in their second main. They haven't passed the turn yet, but they are second main. I was like, what the... Like, if you're missing a land drop, then you should have bottom bottomed yeah. off the scry. So I can't imagine he's missing here, right? I No. I mean, I, maybe he is. Who knows? Maybe, but then you're scrying wrong. <clears throat> you get to draw before you scry, right? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Serum Visions. Good card. Very good card. Jesus. All right. Here we go. Casting spells. Doing something. Watching the clock. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> we are up on the clock. <laughs> By a considerable He, he, he really. did nothing, and we drew another freaking land. How did our opponent not hit a land there? I, yeah. And yeah, sure. Yeah, okay. Yes, yeah. <laughs> Hey! Oh, we could have gone off, kind of. Com combo wombo, sort of, sort of. That would have been on curve too. Yeah. Well, no, because we would have that on turn three, and then drawn that on turn four, and drawn that on turn five, and then yeah, they wouldn't have. Yeah. But hey. Well. Okay. Sure. Uh, pfft. round one victory. We'll take it. See you in round two. If you'd like to purchase Magic Online cards with event tickets while logged in on Magic Online, look at MTGO Academy's selection by trading our official bot, Academy Cellbot. You can find it in the Magic Online trading area or at its your buddy list. So we had a slight um, audio issue, so we're going to be re-recording the audio for track for rounds uh, two and three, but we don't remember it very well, so we'll be talking as if we're seeing it for the first time. Uh, this seems like a good keep, and that is annoying. That is super annoying. Our hand's pretty good, though. Yeah, we're probably going to kill that right away with Incinerate, I think. Yeah, that seems like a good thing, because he can... Yeah, Incinerate, I think, is going to happen. So uh, our hand can definitely do some, some, some work if we can get more land. land. Just spend the whole turn leveling it up. Just level it up. Pass the turn. Just level it up and pass. Don't. Okay, yes. sweet. Now don't play anything else. Just stop. You don't need to... No. Aww. Darn it. What is it? If it's another elf, that's also... Ooh! Lotus that is Cobra. also bad. Now I don't know what we kill. So much mana. <laughs> that is super... Oh, man. <laughs> You're coming up at the wrong time, Bonfire. All right. That uh, would be incredibly sweet. Yeah, one more... One turn later, and we would have been able to two-for-one that. Oh, mm -hmm. wait, no. No, because it's a one-two. Yeah, it's a one-two now, isn't it? a one-two, yeah. yeah. So nothing else to do with the turn, so I guess we just... I think we incinerate that because or the load they're both they're scary. both really annoying like that's pretty i mean both essentially right now are producing can produce two mana a turn sort of yeah well the, I, no the tree speaker produces two mana on her own yeah the cobra just adds an adds additional next, one yeah so it does fix though but i think yeah tree speaker is gonna die because uh with the cobra being a one we can kill it with bonfire. Bonfire, if we really have to, we can just make X as one and cast it for three mana, and maybe we'll also kill course, something else. We do need one more land for that. We do need one more land for that. We need one more land for a lot of things. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. You, he gets a creature or enchantment. Ah, so he might not have land. Creature or enchantment, and he revealed lots of lands. Mountain for Emrakul. Emrakul. Ooh, okay. Emrakul is so big. So three land, Wood Elves, and Emrakul, which he's not taking because there's Emrakul's shuffle trigger. 
So he took the wood elves. Yes. Okay. I guess so. Yes, you may shuffle that all away. Okie dokie. Oh, and he does get to... He doesn't get to... Does he get to cast <gasps> the wood elves here? No, because they're no, three No, because it's like a three or four drop, isn't all it? All right. Yeah, they're three mana. Yeah. And then you get a, another thing. So what's he going to cast with this? He only he has one mana for this? Yeah. And a scry trigger? Yeah, so he's getting two... Oh, right, right, right. He only gets one mana because yeah. the temple comes in tapped. tapped. Right, okay. It's not like there's... Not like there's any lack of single mana cost. El no, good. Hooray. All right, land, please. Oh, right. Land or death. <laughs> right, Lotus Cobra can attack. And quite well, too. Yeah, I forget I mean, these things. Yes, Sweet. okay. Okay, I'm going to play Gutter Snipe, I think. Or, well, we could just Brimstone Volley this. What do you think? Is this... Um. Uh, we know he's going to get... Like, if he plays Wood Elves, and it's like the next turn we need to worry about it. I think I think we're okay to let Lotus Cobra live another turn. Maybe I'm wrong. We got two ways to kill it, but... I don't know. I kind of want to get Gutter Snipe down. I don't really want to... Yeah, I'm not super big on the whole... Um, using Bonfire here to kill one dude, so... I yeah. Think, yeah. We'll do that, and then if we do get Bonfire, then we get to do that damage plus two. This also stops the attack, because he's never going to... He's never going to trade Lotus Cobra. Well, like, we would gladly trade Gutter Snipe for, for Lotus Cobra. Yeah. So. All right, well, okay. so, so he has five mana. Five mana, that's fine. That's not unreasonable in a game of cube. Adding black mana. What is this sorcerer? I sort of hadn't considered that he would be splashing for a third color. That, mm, okay, okay. So four, five, five, four. Little magic online hiccup there. Oh, Nissa, cute, great. And now so he has a four, four. With a four, four mountain. That's awesome. Okay, I mean we have ways of kind of killing four. Four toughness is actually really difficult for us, and he is attacking with the Lotus Cobra. What a monster! When I say we would gladly trade off the gutter snipe, I was actually not. I was lying. Because we need that, I think. Yeah. Uh, it, especially with Nissa down now, its ability means if we can, we can easily kill Nissa this turn, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we can, I mean, we can Brimstone Volley to Nissa and redirect the Gutter Snipe damage to it. Uh, we can attack Nissa down to two, and then like Brimstone vo Volley, volley the, his face, the Cobra, or the Cobra. And, Put the gutter snipe damage. Like, there's a couple different ways we can do it, or yeah. we could just use our use our bonfire as a one for one for the lotus cobra, but then also get two damage in on this. So one way or another, this is going gonna die this turn. It just yeah. depends on how we're gonna do it. So let's attack first. Pretty sh pretty sure you can redirect gutter snipe. Yeah, you absolutely can. To opponent. So I think you attack him. Yeah, you attack Nissa. Yeah, we cast brimstone volley, killing the cobra. I guess or. Nope. Oh, you know, no. We're just, gonna, <laughs> just burn him out. Just gonna dome him. Well, this is gone. So there we go. I realize it's sort of breaking the fourth wall, but in retrospect, I think we should have killed the cobra. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know I why we did that. Confused by that. Oh well. Um, what are you doing past us? Come on. <laughs> yeah. All right, uh, we're taking six. Taking okay. six. Great. Desperately need to draw some land here. Yeah. Because best case scenario right now is we either kill the Cobra with a bonfire or play a 2-1. We need to get to five mana so our Stormbreath Dragon can trade with the mountain. Okay, Wood Elves, we knew about that. So then they get another <laughs> get a forest card. Well, they've already got their stomping ground. It does so. make our bonfire a little bit better. <laughs> they do have a Taiga, though. Oh, goody. Um, so now they got two more mana. Another X one. Search for tomorrow. Ah, uh, he's all right. Suspended search for tomorrow. There it is. So now we have a chain lightning. Uh, so we can chain lightning something, and man, one more mana, and we could. Uh, uh, and it doesn't kill the mountain. Or we can bonfire, we can bonfire kill, kill both his other creatures. Yeah. Uh, we 
could play the Chain Walker and Chain Lightning, but I don't think that helps at all because it's just a 2 1 if we want it to block. You know what? Maybe I think we just Bonfire. It's a, you know, it's not the best Bonfire has ever been, but it's a 2 for 1. We get to do 2 to our opponent and then we attack because yep. we're not going to block with a Gutter Snipe and then we do 2 more. It, it seems okay. Oh, also one from the Bonfire. Yep. That's, yeah, that's not that's, nothing. That's not nothing. I always uh, forget that Bonfire does that. Yeah, yeah, it's, it just it's, randomly it's, also hits them. All yeah, right, let's okay, do that. So, bonfire. so single red, one one, do that. Get him. So that's two damage to them. Man, I love gutter snipe. I never got him to work in uh Gate Crash? I think that's where he's from. Yeah. Or no, he's from RTR. I think. Excuse me. He was <coughs> Yeah. He did not. <coughs> Pardon me. Yeah, I never got him to work in limited, but uh, he's doing well today. So we're both on ten now. He's got a four four with trample. We have a two two, but we do have a whole bunch of stuff in our hand. We just need a little bit more mana. We got five points of burn off that chain lightning. Oh, Ooh. now he oh, has no. two four four tramples. No, that's Neat. not okay. And he will attack. I assume. I would. Yeah. So now we're at six. Okay. All right. Could could be could be better. Okay. okay. Well, hey, that's land. So that, we that's a hell rider if we want. Although that does almost nothing for us. Um, I think that's our it, best. It bet, gives though. us a double block though, which is yeah. Like we can't play our five drop. Perforos does absolutely D Perforos nothing. Block. I think we have to play hell rider and double block one of his four fours. <coughs> we could. We could play the Chain Walker at Chain Lightning him for five. Yeah, it seems no. Uh, yeah. It's so close because it's like we could play Chain Walker, keep it back, like leash it. That still gives us a double lock and a trampler. And then, and Chain Lightning and take him to five. Double block with the Chain Walker and the Gutter Snipe and then play Hellrider. Which would deal four on his own if he got through, assuming yeah. he got through, which I don't think he will. No, I think this is better. It's not good. No. <laughs> this is not an ideal scenario, but But we kill his guy here, we get left we're probably left with gutter snipe. Which is I would rather be left with gutter snipe, honestly. Yeah. I mean I assume I don't know, like I guess maybe he maybe no. he just kills gutter no, snipe. Oh, if he's only Oh he can't but, Dancy Dancy Dancy. Well, what? There we go. Oh, okay. So I think we double block the mountain. Yeah, I it guess so. The May greatest. It's utility. the only thing that it's the only thing that does something else. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> the other guy's just a four-four trample. So, so we do this, and I guess he kills. Yeah, he kills Hellrider, which I think is smart because then he can. There's a easy. It's easy for him to take a lot of damage out of nowhere with Hellrider and something that like makes tokens or whatever. But I. I'm okay with. This, I'm though. I'm pretty happy with yeah. him leaving Gutter Snipe around. Okay, now is are we just dead? He took the time to order the blockers, so I assume that we're not just straight dead just burned of some sort. Dead. He does need six mana for something. What is he what do you need six mana for? That's not good. What do you and possibly Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. I'm less afraid of that at the, <laughs> yeah. at the moment. Five mana. Okay. That means we can play our Stormbreath Dragon to trade with Gorklan Rampager. Huzzah. All right, I'm gonna almost gonna, gonna attack with Gutter Snipe because even if he kills the dragon, Gutter Snipe isn't an effective blocker because he tramples over for two damage anyway. Yep. So yeah, you go Storm Breath. You <laughs> trade with that four four. No, don't kill it. What Pre combat. What are you doing? Never good. This was Three, our out. Four five. Don't. Six. What uh, is going? Oh. Oh. Deal. Yeah. That's oh, so just, we're dead. They we're just dead. Okay. Man, there was an Inferno. I never saw that. That would have gotten our deck. That would have gotten in our deck all that day. That would have been our day. only six drop. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. I think this game was closer than it looked. I think we were clawing our uh, way back. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well. All right. Sideboard. Um, but. Uh, Slagstorm, did you kill anything? Like we're all No, all his things were four toughness. Flame slash though. Yes, let's bring in the flame slash for the four toughness awful things. And probably cut one of our like 
Mortars yeah, like good. lightning strike, or lightning strike, and incinerator sort of the same. So I guess incinerate's we'll better than lightning yeah. strike, though, right? Yeah. So sort of the same. I said not, not just the same. Uh, yeah, let's play first. That's, Always play first. That's aggressive. Fine. Yeah, you know what? I like that. It's a little awkward. We can't play the mute vault until like turn until three. Turn three. But that's fine. So we don't get any early mute I vault mean, beats. But if uh, we go one drop, two drop, three drop. And with the Mute of All on three. Yeah. I feel like that's a pretty strong start. I think if the War Driver wasn't double red, there'd be an argument to play the Mute of Vault on Oh, at one. first. Yeah, and leave the Bushwhacker. And then hey, s- just start else. slamming with the Mute of Vault and s- save the Bushwhacker for later beats, but I don't think he'll trade this. I don't think he trades either. No. No. Okay. But this, I actually dig. Bushwhacker, like a 1-1 one, one is not exciting, but a 1-1 one, one into a 2-2 two, two with Battle Cry, and then into another 2-2. Two, two. I like where this is going. Also, Muta, uh, Battle Cry Muta Vault not, is not nothing. Nope. And pass. Dang it. <laughs> At least tap your elf. Whenever they pause, I'm always like, ah, ah, oh, darn. All right. Play something boring. That's well, that's kind of boring. It doesn't do anything immediately. It means we get in for some damage Worrying for later, here. yeah. Yeah. All right. Get, out, get the vault out there. Don't know why I played that pre-combat, but whatever. I mean, he goes to 15 here. Always yield the battle cry. I take four. Like, it's a pretty good start. And now we have a 2 2, which means now if we like, yeah, I feel pretty good about the start. Yeah, if we just go ham next turn with Mute Vault and everything, I'd like to draw um, another spell, though. A spell would be fantastic. We certainly have a lot of land. Okay, search he's for tomorrow. suspended okay. search for tomorrow again. He still has Forest. five mana available this turn. More boring things. Things that can't. That's uh, no. Man. That shuts basically our entire board down. Hmm. Okay, flame slash, and flame slash. Oh, that is the opposite of flame flash. Flame, flash. flame, flash. flame flash. Okay, so we just do nothing here. That's oh, exciting. That sucks. <laughs> this deck wants no, to be just yeah, jamming in there so hard. Nothing but that, like doing nothing on turn four in a mono red deck. That just giant brick of a rampager really puts a stop to our. I stuff. mean, we have flame slash. We have mortars. Yeah. Uh, we have ways of dealing with these things. We do. We just somewhere. need to draw them. Har- oh, Ooh. that's cool. Just that won't draw be good th- later. Draw three cards in green. Why not? He still has three mana too. He might even have four because I'm pretty sure he had didn't play a land this turn. Or maybe I'm miscounting. But anyway. And three drop. What is it, mm. sir? <laughs> Hmm. There it is. Okay, more wow mana rocks. So that's five, six, seven. That's ten mana. He's got five yeah. away from Emmercool, and he's got search coming in. Next. Ooh, wait. So wait a minute. If we cast that, do we just steal? Can we his, just kill him here? Yeah, I think so. Steal that five, and that these have nine, haste. Hang on, does he got it? <clears throat> All right, so so 13, it's we can't activate the mutable, but so it's yeah, no, it's death because battle cry. Th- four from four, this, four, and then nine yeah, from the, yeah. when you include Battle Cry. It, it's, oh, this is... It equals him dead. That was the perfect draw. Wow. Can you stop us for three colorless? I don't think so. I don't think so. Oh. And yep, wow. there's 16. <laughs> wow. Okay, that was a good draw. I forgot we had Conscript. Such a good card. Okay. Love that card. Uh, let's I think we're okay to run back. this back. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. We want Smash. He showed us a lot of of the mana rocks. Mana rocks. Yeah. yeah, like we could. It also does three to him. It's true. Um, uh, awkward if he doesn't have the mana rocks, though. True. I mean, like he's shown us. We've seen three. Yeah. We we saw the the chalice and the power stone. Power and stone the monolith. monolith. But I guess I think we just go with this. Just I gonna, think like it's super aggressive and. Yeah, oh, this is wow. a freaking amazing hit. Ooh. Hell Rider, fodder, war Ooh. marshal. Oh, man, yes. Turn one, Bushwhacker, turn two, uh, I guess, marshal, turn three, fodder, and then turn four, Hell Rider, take a million. I mean, he's getting he's done fairly well with his turn one elf every turn, but yeah. I feel pretty good about this hand. <laughs> oh, this is gross. This is kind of what we wanted to do with the tokens and the Hell Rider, so. Yeah, and then we got a Brimstone Volley for later. Don't. Oh, don't be like a tree speaker. Or something. Well, no, he would have played tree speaker turn one. 
Oh, okay. A chalice for There's one. that chalice. It's a small one, but it's a chalice. I mean, he can two-drop here. If it's he, ramp. He is not two-dropping, though. Good. Fantastic. Oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> Please, yes. Uh, he's still going to attack, because I still don't think he's going to trade. And now we get two more 1-1s. One yes. Definitely need to uh, pick up one more land, but I think once we get to four, we're in really good shape, because we can just... Play Dragon Fodder, play Hellrider, attack, ping him for a million, and then... And Hellrider doesn't even need to attack. No, the and, crazy then, part. and then, like, Bombardment gets out, and we just sack everything, and ugh. Yeah, and he's building up his land, but we, uh... One ones are of no concern to us. Stomping ground. You gonna pay for it? Dare you to shock yourself. <laughs> no. Even closer to death. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, whoa, Nykthos. Nykthos. Okay, he doesn't have enough devotion to make Nykthos do anything good. So I'm not paying Echo because I want to play Dragon Fodder. And Cackler. Oh, and Cackler. That seems good. <laughs> yes, please. <coughs> All right, so still just attacking because I, I guess if he wants to trade a Wood Elves for either of these guys, that's, that's fine. fine. Yeah. Take out more blockers for later. Didn't think so. All right. So, fodder, goblins, cackler, sure. <laughs> We're never blocking, so why mm -hmm. not? He does have a lot of land. We just like swing with Hellrider. He takes a ton, and then we just scoop everything to the bombardment. Yeah, I mean, if we draw a line next turn, we can swing with, with Hellrider, Hellrider, get in for... Probably like what? Oh, they almost. got different. I just realized they got the different goblin tokens. They got the Jund goblins and the uh, the other ones, whatever they are. Dominaria, I think that's time spiral. I, I don't know. Uh, yes, yeah, he's gonna take a lot of damage off Hellrider. Although he does have, well, there's only five mana. He's got a possible seven. Hmm. Oh, Primal Command. Wow, that's a lot of life you're going to gain. So he's gaining seven, and he's going to look for a creature. Uh, I have a guess. He's still a lot of mana away. F oh, wait. Yeah, he's still quite a ways away from being that's able to true. cast yeah. Emrakul. He might, not, he might not be going for Emrakul. There's other big, I mean, scary things. Eh, no, nope, he went for Emrakul. He went for All right, Emrakul. go big. I respect that. So I guess he probably has, like... A way to cheat him in, or uh, a couple of those mana rocks sitting in his hand that he's going to cast. I guess. Because, like, Monolith and, and, yeah. All right. Well, time to go ham with Hellrider. Did you just gain seven? Time for you to lose seven and more. Because he's taking six he's... just off the attack. <laughs> and he can't double block. He can't even double block Hellrider, so we're getting in with Hellrider. I think so. Cause, yeah, we I mean, just attack with everything. Technically, he has... One and a, oh, yeah. so one many the green. Triggers. There's a button for this. I think it's F7, but I never remember. So we're just going to stack them manually. But I doubt he's running a combat trick. So does what, he it, like... Is why I'm not worried. No. So like he... I don't know. I might just chump the chump, Hellrider. Ch just chump Hellrider. Ch chump... Because he already took... He's already taken... He's gone he back already, down to 17. Yeah, he already took the 7 that he gained off Primal Command just from the, the attack step. Yeah. Doesn't no blocks. Okay, so he just straight wow. goes to seven. So okay. I mean, he's got to have a way to. Uh, I is, think he's is tooth and nail in the. I believe so. In the cube still. I know it used to be. I don't. It used to be. I, I, I don't know. know. I don't think it's in the new list. I mean, there's there are several ways to cheat out an Emrakul. I, I didn't even think sneak attack was in the new. Was in the new version. Well, something's here because I feel like he wouldn't have taken all that if he couldn't get Emrakul down right. Ow. Through the breach. That's the one. Wait, that was we in pass that? We, that, was, <laughs> yeah. that, was in our, that was in our first pack, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so he has an Emrakul. Ooh. But it wasn't cast. He, he doesn't cast it, so he doesn't get an extra turn. Yeah. And it goes away at the end of this turn. Yeah. But he does... And it can't kill us, actually. No. We have to sack some stuff. We have to sack he can't six actually, things. He can't kill us. But again, we're at seven. So, okay, so if he... We're going to five. He's he's absolutely attacked. I mean, we could... Maybe we'll go to three? 
Actually, no, because he can't he afford. Does, <laughs> I was just saying he does something. He obviously isn't running a combat trick. If he does have like just honestly a giant growth actually kills us here. <laughs> yeah, he can't attack with the elves because he would just be dead on the swing back. Okay, so I think what we need to do is sack like two land and then just the rest. Of all goblins. these goblins. Yeah, and then that way we can attack. Then we can play. If we draw land, we can play brimstone volley. If we don't, we can play goblin bombardment swing. Get the Hellrider triggers, deal the damage from, he'll block two of them, so I guess like one off of that, so he'll take three, and then four, four and then, and then sacrifice. we scoop up to the bombardment. For the three for creatures we have three left. For lethal. So, yeah. And we, if we draw a land, then we can Brimstone Volley, and that's even better. Yep. Okay, so oh, definitely. We, we might actually do this. So, okay, so four goblins, two lands. Yeah. Have to go. Okay, so all, all, right, all of you, go, all, you all you've all done you Sterling service, good day, and these two mountains. <laughs> Okay, and we go to five. Yeah, yeah. Also, we go to five. <laughs> and <laughs> kaboom. I mean, that's less less re- that's less relevant because if we don't kill him, yeah, we this need turn- to. Well, kill actually, him. he doesn't actually have us lethal. No, on the crackback because Emrakul goes away now. Yeah, but then it dies and gets shuffled back into his library, which of course is, which means he can theoretically do it again. Okay. Stagger Sim shock, shock doesn't do doesn't do it. So no, so we just attack. He blocks these two. He takes three and a four from the bushwhacker, and then, and then play bombardment and sack all three creatures. Yes. We'll play this pre-combat so that he can see his his doom his coming doom coming towards him. I yeah, guess I don't, know. I don't think there's anything he can do for double green. Yeah, but that's loose playing that pre-combat. But whatever. He blocks there. And he blocks the cackler. He's going to make us do it. He's got three green mana. Okay, well now uh, he can't do anything. Got to try it. Sacrifice. Boop. Sacrifice. Boop. And sacrifice. Boop. Yes. Got there. Yes. Goblin bombardment. Oh, that's all I ever wanted to do. It's so good. All right. Round three. Love playing standard on Magic Online? Check out Academy Standard Bot in the Magic Online Classifieds for standard singles. Once again, Bonfire, why are you here? Go away for just a little bit longer. Why are you always in our opening hand, Bonfire? That said, we keep this because it's, it's insane. It's fine. Yep. It's. I don't two, know if it's insane. It's two lands. I don't know, like if we draw a couple lands, it's that's pretty oh, freaking good. Okay. okay. Hmm. <laughs> the mono black aggro deck, I would think. At least at least heavy black. Oh boy. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Bonfire is getting X very ones. interesting. Bonfire yeah. is gonna be super good. Um Chainwalker. Yeah, Chainwalker. You know what? Unleash because YOLO. So I think I think if we kill those guys we can win this race. We really need to draw a land next turn though. Tap out three. Oh, oh. Oh, and we, that doesn't even die that to the... doesn't die to the bonfire. Right, well... I mean, it doesn't die, die to the, the one If bomb. we draw a land, we still got to do it, because he can... He's tapped out for the shade. For the shade, yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. I mean, we can't do any... Like, our other option is, like... Take six. Well, we have lightning strike and chain lightning. Like, That's, we could yeah. kill a couple things, we but... We kill two things, but We can kill better. two things with one card. Yeah. Let's do that. Shame we couldn't kill the gatekeeper as well. Why couldn't you have played another X1? Also, with the shade mana, he could... What the... All right. All right, well, we can kill that with... Uh, I mean, with Chain Lightning chain or lightning, lightning Strike. Or Lightning Strike. I guess... I guess we actually want to use Lightning Strike because it uses more mana. So the next turn, if we draw a land, we can... Yeah. No, or... I guess... Hmm. Okay. No, I mean, it's I guess dead. With chain Lightning. I mean, we could also kill the uh, Scar Height here. Chain Lightning's well. a sorcery, also. That's the other. That's yeah. the other consideration. So we'll just do that, and then I guess we'll play this Goblin Bombardment, which is a little what else? a little sad at the moment. All right, I think I think we're running through his gas faster than he's running through ours. That said, he has twice our life. He has just drawn two oh, cards. Great. So that, great. That theory is no longer <laughs> okay. Um. And oh right, right. right. <laughs> that guy just comes back forever and ever and ever. Ethervile. Yeah, okay. Sick. Uh, all right. Well, 
guess I'll play Hellrider because it blocks. <coughs> Which is not a great phrase. <laughs> I mean, it blocks pretty good. No, 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 but just but blo- yeah, blocking know, with like, Hellrider at all. It's yeah. just like, hmm. Although, we now have enough, uh, one more red pip and Perforos is active because Hellrider's got double red yep. uh, devotion, so that's good. Oh. Well, bye, Hellrider. You okay. were cool. I, I liked you. Well, also, I, oh, wait a minute. I can just uh, do no, I kill the champion or the the hide because he just because he can't back. bring it back. Yeah. yeah. Ha ha ha! There you go. It gives a value. Also, murderous cut is in the cube now. That's kind of cool. Yeah, that is. It's a good. That, that makes a, sense. That's I a mean, good cube card. Yeah. Out of nowhere with the murderous cut and. Bloodline uh, Keeper, please uh, lightning strike that immediately. <laughs> yeah, that is just instantly dying. In you know, cannot goodbye. Thank you. And why not? And I guess we'll play Perforos, who we cannot sack to Goblin Bombardment because he is not currently a creature. Our opponent has a really good deck. He doesn't have any more. He only has one more card, though. I yeah. mean. His board versus our board is okay, and that was a good card for him to draw. <laughs> and he can easily plus one it because he doesn't have any cards in hand, so he's just like, yeah, whatever, I'll discard nothing. Okay, so we're going to four. What do we draw here? Well, that blocks. It's something. Oh, yeah. Also, we get to just randomly... Oh, we can... We can do that to Liliana. I guess we want to do that to Liliana. Probably. I mean, doing it to him seems kind of not yeah, super not useful super at useful. the moment. He's at 17. We're at four. We're going to have to like trade our war driver for this thing. I mean, we can trade the war driver. Seer. Yeah, that's awkward. Yeah. Oh. Did... Now, you know what I should have done there? The reason I paused in pre-combat. I should have, because I know I'm trading for this. I should have sacked it to Goblin Bombardment in the beginning of combat so that uh, he wouldn't have been able to bring it back with Raid Yeah. Uh, by trading. So I'm not going to trade then. I'm going to go to two because the YOLO life chose me, <laughs> I guess. All right, so... Oh, yeah. come on. Okay. All right, well... Well, now we, now we sacrifice. Yeah. He can still bring it back because he still attacked this turn, but yeah. whatever. Make him use it, I guess. It's not like he has anything else to do with his mana. I don't know. Maybe we should have... I mean, we could have hit him. Maybe We, we could have hit him, maybe. I don't know. And just taking Liliana down to one. I don't know if that's better. I mean, if we get a creature... If we get any creature, she's dead to Perforos. Exactly. So, so. Yeah. Of course, he has an edict that he can... Almost immediately flash back. back if yeah. he has one more creature. Oh, no, no. He wouldn't have been dead to Perforos because of the... Uh, oh, well, okay. Phoenix is... Liliana's still dead, though. Yep. I think. Because we can because we can attack. No, we can't attack. We, yeah, we can. Oh no, because we need to. Uh, ah, but we can block and yeah, sack and sure. Oh, this is gonna be weird. All right, Phoenix, go get that perforous trigger. Yeah, if we'd redirected War Driver to Liliana, or not redirected, but if we would hit Liliana instead, uh, we could have. Um, could have killed her there. but So what we're going to do here instead is we're going to sack the Phoenix in the beginning of combat so the champion can't attack and can't come back with raid. And then... Uh, also, Phoenix is a great target for... Yeah, because we can get raid. it back if we deal damage with the yeah. with a raid. All right, so now don't have anything. Sweet, he had, didn't have anything. Hey, and we have something. All right, all right. This is And we can, yeah, hit him for two. And this actually... He's wow. keeping his Ether Vial on four, which is worrisome. I don't know what he's trying to... There's probably something in his deck that we don't want to know about. All right. Well, he's got Edict Mana now. What? No. Uh, oh, that's right. exactly what that is. So yeah. well, now we just sacrifice pop, it, I guess. Pop him for one, I guess. Yeah. yeah. Got to get that value. Chainer's Edict. Destroy target creature. You take one damage. Sweet. Ooh. Two creatures. <laughs> hey. two, tar- two triggers. Yes. Go Perforos. Finally putting in major work this game. So it's two cards, a lot of land. Even more land. One card and a lot of land. Oh, if he is corrupt, we're in serious trouble. More creatures would be good. I mean, we're getting in here for two. We can 
actually we can get in for four here by using the uh Perforos's ability. Mm-hmm. I guess I'll pay the echo for now. Yeah. Cackler, good. Cackler Ooh, actually, good. this is good. We can even use Perforos's. Yeah, uh, so now we get in for, now we're getting in for six this turn. That seems pretty good. Uh, not six, four this turn. Well, I mean, we hit him for two oh, already. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And now he's at four. <laughs> All right, Perforos uh, doing a lot of work here. Actually, one more thing, and he becomes, he becomes active. Also, we still what have this bombardment you... that we can... Yay, we got there. Sweet. Awesome. Right, he's like practically dead to the bombardment there, yeah. actually. Oh, no, he totally is. He was completely dead to the bombardment, because if we sack War Marshal, another goblin comes into play. Oh, yeah. And then he takes two from that. Yeah. Our opponent, our opponent saw that he was dead on board. <laughs> before we, we saw it. We, before he, was we saw, he was pretty dead on board. Slag Storm seems Slag pretty Storm good. seems excellent here if he's, if he's going to overextend with little dudes again. So we'll bring that in over... Uh, probably another one of the burn spells. No, I like I like Stagger Stagger Shark because it can kill Stagger two of his good. dudes. Uh, bonfire's really good. It might just be Lightning Strike again. I don't know. Like of all of our burn spells, Lightning Strike is probably the, the least exciting, the least flexible. Yeah, yeah. If we want to actually bring in the sl Slag Storm for it, so which I which I do because I. Like he went like turn one, turn two, turn three, boom, yeah. boom, boom, and then we could, yeah. No, I think that's right. Back. What's up, Bonfire? What Bon? Don't even don't even like you anymore. <laughs> you know what, Bonfire? You used to be a card that I liked, yeah. and now nope. But hey, hey, no turn one, and we got oh sweet. And we okay. got turn two. We I'm got a lot happier three. about that now. We got a Mizium Mortars and Incinerate. Bon we have lots of ways to kill things here. That's <laughs> okay. Well, other than that stupid card, which never dies. Ugh. All right, Bloodgast. So he has two cards that... Bloodgast was like... Effectively never die. But Bloodgast was like top tier card when we started playing Magic. It was like... It was it's such a great card. Was it like 20 bucks at the time at the poss store? Possibly. I recall it being very expensive. I really like that card a lot. It's really good. Oh, Necromant. The card we have to kill twice. Ugh. All right. Um, all right. Let's just get gutter snipe down and uh, start preparing the uh, the bonus damage plan. Yep. Yep. I'm still taking it. All right. Just don't kill our stuff. Oh, oh boy. Okay. I don't know how we kill Ooh. that. Our Burn spells do not have the reach necessary I to... I mean, one more mana, away. and we can kill it. Um, hmm. So if we... <coughs> mortars... We can mortars and incinerate. With one more mana. <laughs> oh, right. If we... Right. I thought... I For some reason, I thought we had four... Or we were drawing a fourth. Why did... Oh. Okay. So, uh, other option is like slam in hope he, he blocks blo i mean he if he blocks we, we we mortars it out and that's pretty good mm, yeah or get him with like brimstone volley uses the oh yeah that's true yeah. uses our mana a little bit better i guess yeah um i mean we we basically i think we kind of have to do that because that just kills us <laughs> it super kills so us so quickly especially Extra if we don't draw the land us. i wanted to cast both of these um yeah, I think our best bet is to attack, pray for a block, and then uh, Brimstone Volley the demon. Because the demon is basically just us dead in two or three turns. Yeah. Uh, no, I'm not going to do that. I don't really know. Like, he doesn't have a huge incentive to block. Oh, right. Gutter Snipe actually deals three damage. That's good. Really? All right. Well, there we Wait, go. Wait, what? Sick. Not only is he blocking... But he's blocking the he's blocking the war driver, driver, which seems really weird. But I don't care. Kill it with a brimstone volley. Our gutter snipe lives and gets in for two more damage. Nice. <laughs> gutter snipe might be my new favorite creature. As, I mean, gutter snipe in this in the mono red cube Ooh, deck is just so good. So good. I can't believe we got him last pick out of that pack. Yeah, that's, we did last we? pick. Yeah. Okay, feel free to just draw more gas. I guess. Oh. Wait, these. I guess. Oh, okay. Take your pick of anything. Probably going to take... What would you take? I'd, I, I would take Bonfire, I think. I guess you'd probably take Bonfire. 
I mean, you certainly aren't taking Phoenix. And Perforos is kind of meh. I think it's like Bonfire or like Mortars. Yeah, yeah. Bonfire. That makes sense. Also, he took two damage off that. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, come on in. So many creatures. Okay. Mm. Conscripts, you were awesome a while ago. Not so much here. So now we like have to kill something. I think so. Oh, the blood gas has haste now too. So whenever it comes back, it gets to attack right away. Yeah. Blood gas is really good. Mm -hmm. Really good card. Super cool art too. Um... Yeah, I mean, this just gets us another block or a blocker and start actually like trading. Although, ugh. Yeah, still don't want to block with gutter snipe, so get in there. Champion can't block. So, what does it make the most sense to block? I think the Necromancer. Probably. Because <laughs> Blood Gas comes back for basically for free. Yep. Blood Soak Champion comes back, he's got to pay two mana. But Necromancer. Oh, we don't want to block the champion because the champion's a human. So Necromancer's ability will trigger off it. and oh, Or it doesn't matter. Well, we don't get to block. Cause X damage he's gaining X. how much life? Five? Five? Oh. Neat. And we're going to four? Uh, yes. Yes, I we feel are. not so good about this game. Well, we stabilized well, well last time. Okay, we get to kill two things. Yep. And uh, we get to kill one thing now and then probably another thing. We get to and and trade for something if we have to. So yeah. we're we're not dead. That's yeah, it's a human, so that thing will trigger off. Ugh. Yeah, I think we gotta kill the necromancer and then kill something else. And then block and then, and then block. And go to two. Yeah. And hope he doesn't have anything. <laughs> I didn't else. say it was a good plan. <laughs> Alright, All right, so, so yeah, necromancer. Take two. You die. Make a zombie. Then, yeah, probably. Um, no, probably. Mm. They, those guys just come back, and he's got all the mana he needs. So, like, forcing him to use mana for the champion is like not even that great. Yeah. So, yeah, just kill the zombie and take two. So you're he's back down at ten. Yep. And we're no, not, we're at four. We're, we're not, not dead. We're not hundred percent dead yet. Unless he's got like murderous cut. Well, there's another swamp, so we're corrupt. Corrupt is serious tech. Or that. Oh. Oh no, we're super dead. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Good thing to keep those instants for instant speed stuff, I guess. <laughs> Okie dokie. Uh yeah, can't can't do anything about that. All right. Game three. Game so, three. I like, I like our deck a lot. Yeah. I don't think any of these things help. Flame Slash is interesting. All his things are smaller than that. I mean, it's cheap, which is why it's nice. It's like they're either smaller than that or they make things out of range of it, honestly. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yes, we would like to play first. Always. Hey, Bonfire. Screw you. <laughs> That's three in a row. You you know what? Uh, you just live here now. Slag Storm's kind of fun. Yeah, I actually. It's not is, the fastest this hand. This is though. not a fast hand at all. But it's, I, kind of, it's pretty controlly though. Like yeah, which I super dig actually against his deck. Just letting like, him play stuff and then go into get yeah. Into like if he goes one. Oh, okay, well he didn't go one there. But if he goes like two, three, fours, we can <laughs> easily slag storm him out for pains here. Mm. Okay. Oh, please let us let him. Kill himself off his own pains here, like the Phyrexian Arena in round one. Uh, do we hold the war? I think we hold the War Marshal because we want him to extend. Maybe this is telegraphing it. Who knows? Oh, we'll take two off pains here. That's, that's no big. Gnarled Scarhide. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll play Perforos because we can. Doing something with our mana. Untap, draw a card, swamp. Damn it. <laughs> um, all right. So play another wussy guy, and then we'll just wipe it. Burn him out. If we draw another land, then we can actually Slagstorm and play War Marshal. All right. 
Play a creature. Next three. That's uh, uh, not no, next that's three. not you. That doesn't a... fit the plan. <laughs> <laughs> You're the worst. Land, we need. Oh, damn it! You are ruining the narrative, Master of the Feast. If we'd had land, we could have slag stormed and incinerated, incinerated yeah. and everything would have been fine. Ugh. God, I think we actually chain lightning would would would, would be sweet. Would be but... sweet here. Uh, well, okay. you were right about creatures be either being too small for flame slash yeah, or, or too just big. big. Too big, yeah, because he's got that and he's got desecration desecration demon. Like, uh, man, this guy's deck is very good. Very good. It's nice to see mono black as a thing again. It's not a trap. It's a real thing. Mm -hmm. Um, so we could okay, stagger shot doesn't work. Incinerate. If we stagger shock now. We can rebound it next turn. That's not that good though. Well, I mean, we can kill the we kill like one of the little guys now, and then next turn we know we can kill the master. Uh, yeah. Uh, I think we just slag storm, kill the two little guys. So we take less damage, and then we get to draw. Extra, to draw cards. extra cards here. Not that is not what we needed though. No, because we know we can kill it with stagger oh, shock and incinerate. And I mean, we go to nine in the meantime. He's also off land. Yeah, I think. No, he absolutely is. Or maybe not. No, because we went first, right? Oh yeah. Yeah. So he's still. Whoa. Bitter blossom. That I wouldn't even play that against us. Oh man, Beetleback Chief with Perforos gets get just take six. <laughs> hits, him, hits him for six. That's pretty sweet. And we have Dragon Fodder, so it's just like ten damage in those two cards, and pretty, we don't even have to. We awesome. just have to cast them. Yeah. Well, we can't kill Master, so I guess we're just doing this. Yeah. I mean, we just need to draw one land. I mean, yeah. Bitter Blossom is kind of scary because um, those are the flyers, yeah. But yeah, we ha we do have Bonfire, so if the flyers yeah. get out of hand, we can like Bonfire a bunch of them away. Yep. Chain Lightning do does it. Because now we have incinerate. Oh yeah, and chain yeah, yeah, yeah. So we, now we can actually kill it. We probably should have done the stagger shock play, but I think I'm digging how this is going. I mean, we are. We're four. We're, we're in a bad spot. Yeah, we're not in a great spot. But oh, ugh. okay. Okay. Well, there goes our beetleback chief, but that's that's, that's fine. <coughs> We've got little goblins to block with, so that's okay. Go okay. Oh yeah, kill him. Um. I mean, we just we have to kill. I have to kill the master. The, yeah, the master here. Uh, did, so. Do we do it? How do we do it? Do we, stagger shock, chain lightning. I think that's a better use of the mana. Probably, and then we get a free two damage next turn. Yeah, and then we can't block the fairy, but we can chump the skin render. Go to three. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, let's do that. W. Ha ha. And then shock you. Cool. And go ahead. If those had been instants, we could have uh, drawn out a card off it. But they were not. Well, they, they weren't both anyway. I don't think... I actually don't know about Stagger Shock. I can't remember. I don't think it's... Stagger Shock's not an instant. Yeah. Sorcery, I believe. Um, all right. We're at three. And he gets to Ugh. take away our, you know, crap our Man, bonfire. Man, our bonfire, no. <laughs> Yeah. Dang it. Yeah, that's two times in a row. That was our whole plan. Well, he's going to 10. And we have Perforos out and, like, War Marshal and Dragon Fodder. Wow, we actually get him for eight off of War Marshal and Dragon Fodder. That's true. In <laughs> that's, fact. Uh, and so then he's just dead to any creature the next turn. Yeah. Wow, we might actually be well, able to do this. And we're, we have... Yeah, and we have incinerate. As well, we well. Have, and we have because we have stagger shot coming back, so he's going to ten, and then oh yeah, or he. I mean, we can shock. I don't think no. I think we actually probably have to shock a fairy, because if we don't shock a fairy, oh, he took war marshal. Oh, because he saw that. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Now. Hmm. No, I think. I think we still just go ham to the dome here. Oh, it is an instant. Oh, huh. that makes it a lot even better. Yeah. I always thought it was, it was a really, it's a really good card. All right, so <laughs> um, I think we still just dome him and try to get there because then we can play. What do we? What? How do I? How do I? Oh, oh, that's the, the ability. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. do the go ahead. And there then, we go. Nah, there we go. 
Uh, yeah. Like the skin render we can chump and the fairies we like we can take too. So we drew land, so Oh Oh, this is good. Yeah, we, then can, we can gutter snipe. Yes, and, gutter and, snipe. Get get some for two from the. Oh, wait a minute, gutter from, snipe. Get some. For, get take, gets take some two six. from perforos. So it goes to six. Then, then we, we play, play dragon, dragon fodder, fodder, which triggers gutter snipe for another two, and dragon fodder triggers perforos for fo- twice and takes them to zero. <laughs> Got there. <laughs> yes. We are geniuses. Yes. This is everything I've ever wanted. No, what are you doing? Deals. He's X killing. Damage. Where X, but the ability is already. Oh, because he gains life. Yeah. Oh no. Okay. Oh no. Well, we're still not dead. We get. We have blockers. Yeah. We're going to one though. Yeah, but we're still not. Oh man, that was almost beautiful. Yeah. And still, I mean, fair play. I was like, why is he killing gutter snipe? The ability is already on the stack, but he's because it gains life, and he makes gutter snipe snipe less of an issue. Okay, so we go to one. We actually probably could have attacked with that goblin, but whatever. Uh, yeah, we do. But he has to kill us right now. Yes. Or he's, he's dead just to dead. basically everything in our hand. Yeah. Because uh, we can... We just cast Kiln Fiend and cast Incinerate. We can bonfire for two and take out all of his fairies. We can... But that doesn't kill him. Oh, I guess... It... Well, then, we can, then we can attack. Then we can attack, yeah. We can incinerate and Kiln Fiend. Like, we have a lot of different options. Oh, what's he going to do? Opponent is deep in the tank. Um, There's so many things he could have. Yeah, and he has four cards I don't, in hand. I don't know any of them. Yeah, no, I know. Well, like, I mean, because I don't know the cube. I'm like, what could? Hey, yes! we just we just win three and zero. Oh, it's so good. Boop boop. Oh man, the perforos gutter snipe combo was super good. Yeah, it's just like damage here, here, here. Go, go, go. So. Oh, sweet. All right, thank you so much for watching uh, our. Uh, first draft with the new cube um uh check us out at uh, loadingreadyrun.com or youtube.com slash loadingreadyrun and uh on twitter uh at uh at loadingreadyrun but also at lrrmtg for just uh magic stuff um james's twitter is james underscore lrr mine's graham underscore lrr and uh yeah thank you for listening talk to you next time bye guys